give me roses I wish he could again How nice to know that when Meg is with her Dennis she doesn't like to miss out on all the jiggling. Ah. More from the girls who were off school the day teacher covered ladylike behaviour, makeup and deportment tomorrow morning at the same time. The friend turns granny in home and away. Haven't we heard that one before? Paula, I'm so sorry I didn't read out your Valentine's message back in February, but I'm to tell Neil that you love him almost as much as you do prisoner cell block H. Isn't he the lucky one, eh? This week's most obscure sighting was of Dennis Cruikshank, who was part of the celebrity, and we use the word in the lightest possible sense, the celebrity audience with Victoria Wood, recorded in 1988 and shown recently on a certain satellite channel. Thanks to Kenneth McGuinness of Renfrewshire for that. Now, I'd love to say that I'll be back with more snippets next week, but I won't. I'll be on honeymoon, which kind of presupposes I'm getting married, doesn't it? So I'm now officially the happiest continuity announcer person in the whole wide world. Where are we going? Well, Skegness sounded nice. In the meantime, please keep the snippets coming. Send them to me, Stuart McWilliam. You know the address, and I'll see you soon.